If somehow the God of the Bible existed, I wouldn't want to worship him. Many atheists have said this, and I agree with them completely. I would never want to worship a being who constantly needs to be worshipped all the time, who is petty, narcissistic, angry, vengeful, and jealous. I'd rather burn in hell forever than worship Yahweh's narcissistic ass. Yahweh is evil, he's sadistic, he's cruel, he's vengeful. He doesn't care what anybody thinks except his own rules. He will kill you on the spot if you do not worship him instantly in the Old Testament anyway. In the New Testament, he's all lovey-dovey with the whole hell thing. Why would I worship a being who claims to be just, and that he has killed over 24 million in the Old Testament and in the New Testament alone? Then there's the whole thing about Isaiah 45.7, stating, I form the light, I create the darkness, I make peace, I create evil, I the Lord do all these things. In that verse, in Isaiah 45.7, God technically says that he controls everything. He controls the light, he controls the darkness. He controls what I say, he controls what you say, he controls if my heart stops right now and I die, he controls every earthquake, every hurricane, you name it, he controls it all. So he's technically killed trillions upon trillions. Would you want to worship a being like that? I know I wouldn't. Now does that sound like a loving God killing trillions upon trillions of people? I don't think so. So I wouldn't worship him. I would never worship a being who would create hell for no reason and send you there if you don't believe when he shows no proof of his existence. Even if you were to prove to me that Yahweh exists, I would never worship him. Because no matter what, I'm not gullible, and I never will be gullible. I'd rather burn in hell forever than worship Yahweh.